Hi, I'm Valeria from Local Aromas in Italy and today we're going to be making frittata di pasta with my sister Benedetta. Frittata di pasta is the best way to use your leftover pasta. It's such an old recipe actually that we're taking it from our very favorite Italian cookbook. Very important thing, your pasta has to be cold. Right, because we probably had it the day before, so cold room temperature, we're going to be using eggs. In a separate bowl, you scramble the eggs, you can add some salt and pepper to it because you may want to give it a slightly different flavor from the pasta you had the day before. Then you put the mixture, the egg mixture, in the pasta bowl and you can also we use our hands. No, we use your hands, natural fork. You mix, because you want to make sure that all the eggs coats the pasta. The pasta can be done with, uh, you know, with tomato or it can also be white. Exaggerate with parmigiano. I mean, really go for it, especially if it's white, but here too. So you add in a little bit more uh, parmigiano to give it that little twist. Then you take a pan, warm pan, drizzle it with olive oil so that the entire bottom is coated. And then you take your pasta and you put it on the pan, you sort of smush it down because you're trying to get it all over the place. And what you're looking for is this beautiful, delicious crust that is going to form at the bottom. And then once you have your crust, you take a lid. <laughs> this is the fun part. <laughs> and with magic, a very magic touch, you flip it over. <laughs> It's not that difficult, because it sounds difficult, it's not difficult. Because that little crust that you have on one side, you also want to do it on the other side. So you get the lid, you, you flip it over, and you get the crust at the other side. Because imagine you're making, it, it's going to look like, like a pizza. Exactly, it's going to look like pizza. It's going to look like pizza. So once it's done, and nice and crunchy, you can actually slice it with a pizza. Because we used to have this on our picnics. Always, all the time. Picnics, cold pasta, even in sandwiches sometimes. And I mean, it's so good that you can, I do that. I sometimes make pasta I on purpose because then I want to have it in a frittata. But that's it. You just eat it. You can eat it warm, you can eat it cold temperature, you can eat it with your fingers, with your hands. Appetizer too, you just cut it in small oh, dices. That's a good I mean, idea. You do whatever you want with it and it's wonderful. wonderful. That's the typical Italian frittata di pasta.